splendor How much more will he clothe you? How much more will he clothe you? If he watches over every sparrow How much more does he love you? How much more does he love you? If he dresses a lily a secret like my heart knows a reason You're holy, 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 holy. 
and our praise. We're going to do it a little differently than we normally do, but we have our communion uh, that is up here on each side uh, that you can come and get. And in this time of worship, we're just going to take communion and the worship song together. And so, Father, we just come to you in the name of Jesus. We prepare our hearts for the receiving of communion. Lord, we just thank you right now, God, as we make a fresh surrender. God, forgive us of our sins. Lord, we thank you. Uh, we remember. May we never take for granted. Thank you for the price that you paid, Lord. Thank you for taking of the cup of sufferings and transforming it into our cup of blessings. And we thank you, Lord, as we receive and partake of communion as a family together here in this time of worship.
Lord. You are our desire, O oh God. You are our desire. Lord, I thank you for eyes wide open, Lord God, with wonder. We thank you, Lord, to see the beauty of who you are and all of your goodness, holiness, the beauty of who you are. We just thank you that our gaze never distract. Let it be a, a place of beauty upon who you are. And as we've come here this morning, partaking of communion, loving you so much, we thank you for your glory resting in this place. We thank you for all that you're going to do, Lord, here even now. I love as we were declaring chains fall here now. I love that now. Can you guys recognize you're in a now moment this morning? You are in a now moment. Please let the worship team know how grateful you are as well for leading us this morning. And as the media team helps me out this morning. Welcome to Gateway Family Church. We are so glad that you came to worship with us today. Here are all the exciting things that are happening at Gateway. Hey ladies, we offer two women's Bible studies. One is Tuesday mornings at 10 a.m. with Donna Couchet. The second one is Wednesday evenings at 6.30 with Becky Wyckoff. Come out, fellowship, have a great time, and hear the word of God. We would love to see you. So we hope that you have been enjoying um, the teaching that we've shared. And now we want you to get ready for tomorrow. Tomorrow we're going to talk about the F word. Yeah, fasting. And so fasting is an essential part of our growth. It is that process where we learn to restrain our flesh so that our spirit can manifest. So tune in tomorrow night as we discuss the F word, fasting. Hey guys, last month we had such an amazing night of worship at our Hazelwood campus that we're doing it again tonight at 6 p.m. Come out and experience God like you've never felt before. We can't wait to see you. Hey church family, we have an awesome ministry opportunity for you guys coming up. We are partnering with an organization called Restore Network. So they bless and support the foster families in the Madison County area. So what we're going to be doing as a church, we're putting together game night baskets on May 19th. So these baskets are going to have everything that pretty much puts together the perfect family game night. So movies, snacks, popcorn, card games, board games, all of those things that you can think of. So we're accepting those donations every week leading up to May 19th. All you have to do is bring them to the Welcome Center when you come into church. And then on May 19th at 7 p.m. here on Thursday night, we're gonna be putting together those baskets. We are so excited to have our Sunday night services back. Now, once again, this is going to be once a month, and our next one is going to be May the 1st. For some of you who may not know, these have been some of the most powerful times in Gateway history uh, at our church. The power of God moving and flowing freely. It's a time when we can worship and you can just be free. I tell you what, it's been some of the greatest times that I've had in worship. Gateway Family Church, you don't want to miss it. I hope to see you there. They do so much better at it than I do. Thank you guys so much. Um, something added as well, just Paul came to me this morning is like, hey, we're ready to fire it up with a, a senior's luncheon again. So um, you definitely can mark a calendar on Thursday, the 19th of this month. Wednesday. Wednesday. 
Mark your calendars for what he said. All right. <laughs> but we'll let you know, obviously, but this month we'll be uh, gathering again. Uh, you can tell how well I'm good I'm doing that, obviously. And uh, how many have enjoyed the uh, digital discipleship that's happening? It's been incredible. I want to encourage you. You want to make sure it's the great thing about you can go on and catch up if you need to. If you're starting even just this week, you want to jump on. So I can see those that have lost some weight from the last one of fasting. I, I appreciate seeing that. That's good. <laughs> so we have uh, the incredible opportunity uh, to give this morning. It's always our heart's desire. We're a giving church always have been and always will be. Pastors Happen Sandy always led the way, showing us on the importance of giving. And um, we're going to be giving here this morning and also of a special offering for uh, Prophet Lloyd Bustard and his ministries. One thing that uh, I went into in the early service that we have been blessed. For over 20 years, we've been in relationship uh, with, with Lloyd and Pam Bustard, and we are so grateful and thankful for God bringing us together all those years ago. It's been an incredible journey to have uh, a man and woman of God that's with you, um, that, that uh, it's just been incredible. And uh, Micah has had a word given over 20 years ago. That So how old were you then? 21, 21. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> and uh, but he's, he showed it to me on his phone. But we're talking about in relationship for decades. And um, it's our heart's desire is that, uh, that, that we bless them and right now that they're here for this weekend. And there's so many wonderful gifts that God has to uh, his church. And you guys know my heart for the prophetic ministry or the, the prophets. But he's not here just because it was a Sunday that he had available. But he's here because he's on assignment. See, that excites me and it stirs me so much when God sends his prophets. And I couldn't think of um, a better time than now. And so when I, when I, I hear from him, I'm excited when he's coming. Uh, and then he's coming and he's got something. He's carrying something for us. I got to tell you, you guys missed it. I'm glad you're here on the second service. But the first service was incredible and amazing. And I know it's just going to be the beginning for what's even happening now. But if I was you, I would have been here first service and the service. But that's all right. You made it. You made it. But uh, all joking aside, he is carrying a word in due season. When a prophet goes on an assignment, atmospheres shift. Chains fall, giants fall now, and that's what's, what you're a part of here this morning, and so I'm so glad you are. We're going to do our offering declarations, and one thing in the early service, I was impressed with the passing of the buckets. I was so impressed by the ushers. I was like, look at this, but um, you know of our ways to give. If you're giving online and you want to give uh, to uh, Prophet Lloyd's Ministries, we want you to click special on that. And um, let's do our declarations. As we receive today's offering, we are believing you for heaven open, earth invaded, storehouses unlocked, and miracles created. Dreams and visions, angelic visitations, declarations, impartations, and divine manifestations. Anointings, giftings, and calls, positions and promotions, provisions and resources to go to the nations, souls and more souls from every generation, saved and set free, carrying keen.